the back up in Louis, then go cop a crib on the north side. 1500, that's a gain. No Yo, JP Nation, how you guys doing? I hope you guys are doing amazing. It's your boy Maxim as usual, back with another My Hero Academia, the strongest hero video. Now, if you're new to the channel, welcome. Thank you so much for hanging out here. If you're not subscribed, what are you doing to me? Just uh, click that subscribe button, join the nation. It would be really, really appreciated. And when you're at it, just click that like button. It does help a ton. And with that being said, we're out of the way, the new update is actually here or finally here and uh we finally got aizawa as a rerun banner where it's kind of expected for the past month we only got reruns nothing new in the game and uh i saw a lot of people that have uh, been spending a ridiculous amount of money on the game just like kind of quit and kind of stop their spending i don't know what they're doing i don't think the tactic is kind of there uh, i hope they the uh, the new uh, world mission uh, sort of like thingy is actually gonna be amazing. A lot of you are probably gonna be asking, uh, should you summon for Aizawa? And um, my opinion is this: it depends on uh, like w what you're going to be using him for. If you're going to be using him for arena, he's really really fantastic. And uh, if you're actually going to be using him for uh, PVE content, is not the best character unless you're actually going to be uh, a triple assing him because he's actually going to be getting the extra attack from the triple s he's actually decent when it comes to ss and s but he's not the best you need to like to get his cards and also you need to get him to triple s uh, but if you're actually gonna be using him for arena he's a must have and uh, I, I don't know i think he's actually decent when it comes to warzone as well because he has like the crowd control uh, once he actually uh, like uh, wrap everybody else so uh it's up to you if you actually have the uh, uh sort of like the uh, tickets and also uh, the hero coins to actually summon for him uh, if you have like tickets um, actually saved up I would recommend actually uh, summon for him uh, but if you have hero coins and you're actually going to be uh, actually uh, using those hero coins to buy tickets I would actually uh, recommend you guys to actually take uh, a moment and actually think about it and the reason uh, for it is actually we have a new ticket or separate ticket um, that are actually specifically made for the new event uh, that are actually coming uh, very very soon so if you actually scroll all the way here you're actually gonna be singing a whole new ticket which is our uh, a special item to recruit heroes from uh, the whm which leads me to think that they're probably going to be cramming them up in the same banner which is very very interesting because you're going to be summoning for the uh, three characters or four depending if they're actually gonna be releasing the villain at the same time or not we have to like to wait and see as well but the main thing that actually worries me the most or is actually gonna be ruined it for a lot of uh, like uh, free to play players or light spenders is that uh, like myself for example I actually stopped spending uh, on the game and I went free to play for a while now because I wouldn't uh, recommend you guys like spending because uh, there is no pve content in the game and the main reason is that i stopped spending and actually saved up as well is that i've been saving my pity for the new event i wanted to like to get the new characters and actually uh, just like spend uh, those uh, tickets on uh, these ones so i'm actually like 28 or double uh, sort of like multis away from uh, actually getting the uh the as character but uh if they're actually going to be releasing a whole new uh, sort of like ticket system is actually gonna be ruining it for a lot of people like honestly is actually gonna be um actually cocksucking a lot of people that have been saving their hero coins or their tickets especially if you didn't know about this and you actually went ham and went like oh maybe i should buy a ticket and save them up uh, so i can actually stop myself from spending hero coins on the other things so so now you're actually forced to actually buy stuff and this is this is not not as good as expected because a lot of other games uh, out there they actually keep the same tickets for everything so if you buy like uh, or you have like hero coins or you have like these premium tickets that you're actually gonna be summoning for they're 
they're usually uh, used on the same banner, but they actually uh, kind of made um, a whole different approach. I don't know if they're actually uh, money motivated or not. This probably is because uh, it's not the first time that they uh, took this approach, like honestly, and everything is going to be determined on uh, how they're actually going to be pricing these. Are actually going to be higher or they're going to have the same uh, kind of uh, sort of like range or price range when it comes to these stickers? Let me know what you guys think. Do you guys think this is actually really good that they made uh, sort of like this uh, compromise where they created a whole new ticket and uh, we have a possibility to actually have a whole uh, like uh, characters in one banner as well instead of like getting one ass character you have the possibility to get two or three characters uh, in one banner so that's actually really really interesting to see in the game right now but you get a lot of rewards you get a lot of tickets as well which is very very nice uh, um, it's it, it's decent actually to get like these premium tickets because uh, a lot of you I know that are actually struggling and I hope you get lucky let me know what you guys like think in the comments down below because um, this is a whole new thing <laughs> that uh, we're gonna be seeing in the game very very soon I'm really really excited uh, to see how the characters are actually are if we're actually gonna get the villains as well I saw this render on uh, reddit where they're actually showing off like all the characters the villains and also uh, the uh, whip deco and also uh, like um, Shoto and also Bakugo as well they look really really sick especially when you see them uh, in the game or I think it's actually photoshopped as well but it looks really really amazing I'm gonna be putting it on screen so you guys like actually uh, see it as well uh, like I like I said if you're actually gonna be summoning for Aizawa let me know in the comments how your summons go and also make sure to get his tickets because his tickets are very very uh, important for him if you're actually gonna be planning to use him in the PvE content in the game and with that being said best of luck with your summons as usual and thank you so much for watching as usual and i'll be catching you guys in the next one bye bye